That is where your great-grandmother Gaga grew up. Your great-great-grandfather was once the richest man in Boston. So how come we're so poor? Would you like to see the inside? Are we allowed? You can't just walk up and knock on people's doors. Sweetheart, it's Boston. They're practically expecting us. My father was diagnosed manic depressive in 1967. Can I help you? My great grandmother grew up in this house, and well, I wanted to show it to my girl. I'm sorry, but I don't give tours. That was so embarrassing! He met my mother and told her all about his nervous breakdowns. She didn't care. Why can't Daddy live here with us? Daddy's still recovering from his breakdown. He's a way better cook than you. So they got married, and they had me. Oh. And then my sister. I got into Columbia. You can't take the girls to New York. Here's my proposal. We love you. Bye. You move in with the girls and you take care of them. But we're gonna be late for school. Me? It'd be good for me to, to, to have a routine. Hold on, hold on. Yes, yes, a routine. Have some breakfast. The most important meal of the day. Amelia, let's go! That's a lot of routine. You can do it. Yes, yes. Is this something to do with feminism? You're all welcome to come to our apartment. We don't want people to see how we live. Big deal how you live. It's not your fault. Girls tell me it has no floor. It had no floor. I scavenged these from your kitchen. Why do you have so much stuff? Our dad is totally polar bear. Bipolar. I'm probably sorry you married him. Never. I love you. You want me to pick you up after school? No! I'll be here at three. My ex-husband would never do what you're doing. I think it's so evolved. You do? Most men would be completely emasculated by having their wife go off to be the breadwinner. Oh, thank you.